Here we go from Mackey Arena. And Southeast Missouri will win the tip and they'll get first possession. Green driving, stripped away and stolen by the Boilermakers. Great defense by the Boilermakers. They're able to double down on the driver and cut off the lane. Wide open in the paint. Dumps it off to Stevenson. Terry on the other side now. Ellis, good move for three. Jeez, got it. Janae Terry, so silky smooth. Able to move the ball. Stevenson rims out, but an offensive rebound for Terry for three. Got it. Madison Layden with a three of her own. And Terry up the floor again for Purdue. Ellis driving down the baseline, fouled, and count the bucket. And one for Abby Ellis. Purdue on the perimeter now. Terry driving a little bit. Kicks out for three. Got it. McKenna Layden with the three. And this is the benefit for the Boilermakers playing with the lead like this is they're able to get into their offensive set and work through it and make good use of the shot clock. Harper sinks the three. Three seconds, two seconds, just need to get a shot off. And they do, and it's a great three from Abigail Stevens just as the shot clock expired. Ellis trying to drive to that left side, kicks it out. Here's the three, bang, from the corner. So Purdue, here's the three. Just off front iron, good offensive rebound, puts it up, and the foul. Back-to-back -back buckets for the Red Hawks were on the other end. The Boilermakers are 0 for their last four. They haven't scored in the last two minutes and 18 seconds. Looking to change that now, gets the foul and one. Doyle driving right side, almost loses all the footing, but knocked away. And Madison Layden, a simple left-handed finish, cool as you like. So now, there's Terry again for three. Got it. Madison Layden, another three. 13 points to go along with four rebounds. And now she pulls a steal, and here comes Purdue for three. Ellis, got it. Nothing but nylon. The Red Hawks continue to struggle from the floor. Stevenson looking. For three. Got it. Gave Madison Layden too much space. And she knocks down another three. And that has just been the Boilermaker special thus far. But now another three down the floor. Back to the right elbow. Five seconds on the shot clock. Flowers got a hurry. Gives to Stevens for the two. Good find there. Sima putting the, together their best offensive setup of the, of the evening. And give Terry the ball back out to Harper. And now for three, they knock it down again. Madison Layden kicks out Richmond. Richmond just went straight in, and a block and the bucket. Yeah, Julia Green went right at Mary Ashley Stevenson, took her all the way to the cup. Mary Ashley Stevenson, lucky she didn't get called for the foul. And the three from Caitlin Harper. Driving left side, good finish, and the foul. Rebound Stevenson. He gave to Terry, now she comes up the floor. Great find. That was a great pass. Gave him the old snake eyes to the perimeter and dumped it into Harper. Smith couldn't get the layup to go. Not enough power on that. And then Green wide open on the left side there and sinks the layup. Flowers. Tried to dump it to Richmond and it's taken away. Swanson up the floor and a nice finger roll lay for the easy two. There's just been a influx of D1 opponents that are just really tough and that's a great shot there from Amaya Buchanan and she will look to complete the three point play. And now if they can just dribble out the clock or just hold it for two seconds and that is the ball game final score Purdue 83 Simo 57